Hey guys, it is Mackenzie. Welcome back to my channel. Today is November 20th. It's 3.50 in the morning. But it is all well because I'm going to New York City for the weekend. I'm feeling pretty tired right now though. I like got one hour of sleep I think because I didn't realize I had an assignment to last night. And I'm going with like three of my best friends, Emily, Sydney, and Catalina. My flight leaves at 6 so we're only going for a few days so we definitely wanted the full day today. So yeah, I will talk to you guys when I get to the airport or when I get to New York. But I'm so excited. Let's have the best weekend. I can't wait to take you guys with me. Also, I forgot to mention it's Thanksgiving break time, so that's why I'm home from school right now. And also, that's why I'm going so short, so I have to come back for Thanksgiving and to see my family. But let's go to New York. Looking for me to let's go. Take me on this journey home. I don't wanna wait no more. Let me down the moon. Tell me you'll be on real soon. I don't wanna wait no more. No, that was like a super close up. We're in New York. Mackenzie recommended this yeah. restaurant. She was like, don't hate me if it's bad, but it smells yeah. so good. No, we literally, I went, when I was here last time, I went to Maman in Soho, and it was so good. And then as we were driving to our hotel, I saw one not in Soho, in like Chelsea area. And I was like, we have to go, guys. But right now, it is 10.15. It feels like it's actually Wait, I'm gonna stalk the Instagram. 2 o'clock, because we've been up for so many hours. But we just checked into our hotel and our room isn't ready, so we're just getting food and we're gonna do a little like sightseeing, maybe go to oh, Brooklyn. Wow. And then once our room's ready, we're gonna get ready and then take the day on from there. But we're getting food. I'm actually starving. I woke up at 3 a.m. starving and it's like <laughs> and you slept seven zero hours. hours later. Yeah, and I didn't, I told them already. I didn't. Oh, sleep. you told, she them. told them. Yeah. And I had like a, ma a malfunction <laughs> at the airport. Like, they wouldn't let me take my bag. Because you were scared on the plane. Because you got upgraded to row three. Yes, yeah. they did upgrade me, but they wouldn't let me, like, take my bag on the plane. So, yeah, we're gonna eat, and I will talk to you guys. With tomato soup, that's weird. Yeah. I love you. I just got the spotlight highlighter that I've been wanting, but they don't have the medium contour that I wanted. So I'm gonna go into every Sephora until I find it. And then I just got more of the pillow top because I'm running out. So the tree is hidden there, but it's the ice skinny ring. Doing touristy things. It's so pretty. We're currently in the Dyson store because Sydney wants to buy a Dyson Era, which is so cool, but you can't try it all. Yeah. I don't know. I think under. Someone's coming. Oh my god. Yeah, see? Wait, it did not work. Well, your hair is dry. It, can't, it needs to be wet. <laughs> Wait, why is her hair curled? This is a funny Wait, thing. it's working! There's literally so many wands, like, I don't know. This looks really cool, so if you need a gift, I suggest this. Hey guys, so it is a lot later. We got back to the hotel and we completely got ready. Um, our room didn't end up being ready till later, so we like just put on makeup for like the night and stuff um, <gasps> We are gonna go somewhere and like take pictures and then we are gonna go to dinner Which Emily has been talking about this place. We're going for dinner like 
so highly so I have really high expectations for it um, I'm excited but I want to show you guys my outfit it's all from addicted I'm gonna like put my camera down and show you but I'm gonna show you their outfits first and then yeah I'm actually gonna freeze though okay this outfits very out of my comfort zone but I'm wearing a silk shirt from Tiger Mist, okay. skirt from Revolve, the tights are my mom's Sphinx and they're really squeezing it in. <laughs> I'm wearing dogs and then I just got this leather blazer at Zara today and I feel like it was a really good purchase. I love it. And my bag is a Deacon Voltaire. So cute. Hi, so my dress is from Adika, my jacket is from Zara, and my shoes are Doc Martens. Oh yes, my friends are so pretty. This is how we were before, this is how we're leaving. Like I literally am getting choked. <laughs> I can't say it on my so phone. Fish. You know, it's fine. Guys, like, this it's, is gonna be good timing. We'll it's spend fun. like 40 minutes. Guys, <gasps> look at this window display. Like, I don't even know what this is, but it's stunning. It is. It's beautiful. Yeah, oh it is. my god, it's stunning. Where do you think her yet? Look how cool. I've actually never been to the vessel in all my New York trips. And it's so pretty, especially at night, so this is fun. I don't even know like where this is, but come here guys, it's so pretty. I'm freezing. from dinner a little bit ago it was so so good right so so good. good it was really really good i've never been there i feel like every time i come to new york i go to the same restaurants so it was nice to go somewhere new i highly recommend it to you guys i'll leave the name here i forget what it's called but um we just got back like i said and we showered and it's only like 10 but we're so tired from waking up so early that we're gonna go to sleep and then we're waking up pretty early tomorrow to go to breakfast and we're going to my favorite area soho for the day so it's gonna be a really fun day and yeah i will see you guys in the morning <laughs> We just got ready it's super early it's like 10 15 and we're gonna go get some breakfast and we're going to my favorite area soho guys that's like someone's balcony right there that's i think i was doing my Wait, hair naked. that's really cool <laughs> but we're gonna go get some breakfast go to soho also i think we're gonna stop at ralph's which i've seen all over and i've been wanting to try their coffee so that's really exciting but it's a far walk so hopefully we don't freeze i'm gonna put a puffer over this but i'm just wearing this like i don't even know this like fur vest shout out to my mom this like black blazer my bag and then just some like leather skinny jeans and my converse but i'm very excited for today so let's get going you sit down. Getting a Levain. Tell the vlog, what do you think? Really good. I don't love melted chocolate chips though. So just have gotten them with no reason. We're at the public hotel right now and look how cool this is. I've seen so many pictures here. It's really cool. Sydney's taking some photos. So good. Yeah. yeah. Hello. It's been a while since I spoke to you guys. <laughs> we are ready and we are going to dinner right now at Catch. I'm pretty sure it's right there. Um, we just went back to the hotel and we like changed and stuff. We took some photos and then we just Ubered some here now. So we just finished at Catch. We're in the bathroom. It was 10 out of 10. What do you think, Emily? My mom was... 
much. My role was really good. Yeah, me too, me too. I don't know how these doors work. <laughs> you just, yeah. <laughs> she kills. Hello, everyone. It is the next morning. It is our last day in the city. I'm really sad. I don't want to leave. But. We just packed up all our stuff and we're gonna go get coffee and a bagel and then walk to Central Park, I think. It's kind of a far walk. Then we have to leave our hotel like by three to go to the airport because our flight is at 5.30. So yeah, that is a plan. I'm just in comfy clothes. I'm wearing sweatpants, a little tank top and this jacket. Yeah, let's go enjoy the last couple hours in my favorite place. <laughs> Central Park, it's freezing cold, but it's worth it. It looks so pretty. Way more when you're by my side. Just stay the night. It's been a while. You're not like those other guys. If I'm being honest, you're all that I wanted. Cause you make me wanna change. I broke a few hearts or two. Now I'm gonna get this right. No, I'm not a hard martyr. Nothing ever seems alive